Hey Saggy, welcome back. I hope you guys are doing well today. This is going to be for anybody with Sagittarius placements in their charts. Make sure you all flip and you switch the roles. Take what resonates, leave what doesn't fit for your situation, guys. Thank you all so much for your love, your support, your donation, and your super thanks. The love never goes unnoticed, and I am returning that back to you all tenfold. Okay, anything you guys need to know about me is going to be down below in the description box. And please be aware of the fake pages that are on here and on any other social media platforms, okay? So let's see, Saji. Spirit gods, angels, ancestors, ascended masters, gods and goddesses, please return any spell work, any dark magic that is sent to harm Saji and their loved ones. Me and my loved ones returning back to the sender. Block any interferences that could be stopping the messages from coming through. Clear, concise, and precise messages for my Saggies. And protect me as I channel the messages here for Sagittarius. So let's see. Okay. What was going on for my Sagittarius? We have temperance in reverse. Damn. That's you coming out first in the reverse Sagittarius. So this could be another Sagittarius here. So we got the Temperance Reverse, Six of Cups. Somebody could be a Sag Scorpio Cusper. <clears throat> so what? Uh, some of you guys could be in conflict here with your children is what I just heard. Temperance Reverse though, something, there's discord, disharmony somewhere, lack of peace. Okay, 10% in reverse. Something is just in balance here. This could have something to do with the past. This could be you maybe clashing with someone from your past. Or they, they got problems with you, child. But there's some sort of imbalance here. Maybe because somebody needs to do some sort of inner child healing. Somebody needs to make peace with something. Okay, the high from reverse. Hmm. Taurus energy. And the Queen of Swords. Oh. So what I'm getting from this Sagittarius, somebody don't like the truth. <laughs> somebody can't, somebody doesn't really like the truth here. You're clashing with somebody because you know the truth about them. The hierophant in the reverse is somebody, some, for some of you, somebody here is doing something unethical or did something that was immoral or... Um, some sort of negative patterns here are on repeat. And I feel like you can give advice for that. Or you see, you see there's, there's something that's imbalanced here. But I don't know if somebody even like the truth or not. Yeah, the Ace of Swords, Six of Swords, uh, Ten of Swords, hmm. Huh? For some of you, I just heard somebody could be in, in conflict with a group of people that do unethical things somebody could be in some sort of group they're conflict they're uh going back and forth or clashing with a group of people because of some sort of truth you're telling or but it's about something that someone did in the past hmm you'll see though okay yeah will the fortune reverse under the six of cups what else yeah, look at the look at the group of hoes right here. <laughs> and the five of wands. Yeah, five of wands under the hierophant reverse. Mm -mm. Uh Leo Saturn. Oh, somebody here feels like it's your fault that they're they're going back and forth with a group of people, but that's because they're a liar. Bitch. Okay. <laughs> like, what the fuck? Let's see though. There's a lot of unwelcome changes here. For some of you, somebody feels like your gifts or you speaking out or you speaking up about something that probably they did to your ass is causing conflict. They shouldn't have lied. They shouldn't have fucking lied. <clears throat> they shouldn't have fucking lied here. So I feel like that's too bad for their ass. Yeah, the Eight of Wands, communication. Yeah, about this King of Wands reverse, Knight of Pentacles in the damn reverse. Somebody here that really, is, they don't want to be seen at all. 444 on the timer. Yeah, they don't want their they reputation or nothing to be ruined, but they want to get on your nerves. Though. I feel like, fuck no. Fuck a no. <laughs> Air their ass out, period. Lying ass. I know they just, I just know they lied about something. So what's the temperance reverse? 
Yeah, Queen of Pentacles here and the Page of Pentacles. <laughs> oh, for some of you guys, you could be readers. You could definitely be tarot readers. Okay, so they say, I mean, shit, it ain't gonna be for every damn body. 5'11 on the timer, but somebody is definitely a reader here. You could be getting good news about your finances as well, um, Queen of Pentacles. That's definitely you, Sagittarius. You could be on the Capricorn Sag cusp. The Sag Capricorn cusp, rather. But definitely you could be a reader, okay? You could be studying something as well. Mm -hmm. So somebody somebody got beef with you or they they there's some sort of mess going on. Or somebody's like trying to bring you discord or disharmony. Because they, like they've been trying to do this though for what you do for work or something like that. They've been getting on your nerves here. So now they shit is coming out and they're upset. What's the fuck? What's the six of cups? This could be somebody you got kids with. Yeah, the cherry reverse child and the damn hermit. <laughs> Yeah, the cherry reverse and the hermit. Somebody here is hiding. The cherry reverse talks about a, a, a not having a sense of direction, forcefulness, aggressiveness. Somebody here is hiding out because they're in trouble with some shit. For some of you, I'm also getting somebody here could be stuck in their ways. Their belief systems are distorted. And I feel like you have the answers and the key to help somebody. But they're going to have to go through their own mess to find their way out. So that way, because I feel like it'll confuse you if you try to show this person something now or tell them now. They'll just be like oblivious or not really oblivious, but just lost because they don't know what you're talking about. It's like it could be frustrating you that you see somebody on a deeper level, but they're, they're not going to understand it because of their level of consciousness. OK, so that's another message. But, um, yeah, I see the seven of swords poking out and the the judgment upright. So this could be somebody consciousness kicking in, somebody going through an awakening. Okay, but. Let me see, what's the cherry reverse? Because that's blockages. Um, Let me see. That's like love winning over hate here. <laughs> like. Okay, Nine of Pentacles. What's Cherry Reverse, Nine of Pentacles? Hmm. Queen of Cups, Eight of Pentacles. Yeah, it's something that you do. <laughs> Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, you could have in your chart. Virgo, Virgo, Venus here could be significant. Yeah, you guys could, could definitely do something creative here. Um, You could definitely be working in the spiritual community or you do something spiritual. You're a psychic. There's a gift here coming towards you, too. There's something that you're really, really good at. This is, could be like a new career path, a new phase, okay? A new direction that you're just taking in life here. I feel like you definitely do a lot of shadow work. You've done a lot of shadow work. That's a lot of inner work here that you've done. But I feel like this is about something creative that you're doing. This could be, too, like a business. Nine of Pentacles could be business, a business property, Okay, some of y'all renovate homes or you remodel them or you're an interior designer. You could be doing real estate or you maybe could have gotten a home. So congratulations. Um, but the, the Nine of Pentacles also talks about freedom. This is like financial freedom I'm getting. Yeah, Page of Cups, creative expression. Hmm. So either it's you that don't have a sense of direction, even though I don't really feel that. I feel like somebody here is being hateful or they were, they was hateful. They lost out on something. Like somebody here was being nasty towards you is what I'm getting. Cause, or somebody is blocked from coming towards you. They're experiencing a blockage here because they need to, they need to do some more soul searching. What's the hermit? Okay. Yeah. Look, the judgment. Yeah. What's the hermit with the judgment? Okay, the Hierophant. Wow. <laughs> the Hierophant upright with the judgment. So for some of you guys... Okay, I'm getting a lot of messages. This is like your own morals, your dignity. Um, somebody here could be watching you like from the sidelines and seeing that you are being vindicated from something. You're being seen as somebody that's respected. 
okay and you're the one with the morals the dignity and everything else they're being seen it like they're they're getting ready to be going through some shit because people are going to be looking at this person crazy but for some of you this could be your uh i just heard this could be your divine masculine there could be somebody from your past that wants to reconcile with you but i feel like i feel like it's good energy i just feel like this person is blocked from coming towards you right now until a lesson is learned with the judgment and the hierophant upright because we got we do got the hierophant in reverse and depending on what i'm saying in the readings yeah the lovers those could be counterparts to me so you have a counterpart here that's doing a shadow work doing some soul searching here or going through some sort of like awakening to step up and be a leader and um definitely a lot of uh, past life things coming up for somebody this is like somebody here going through life lessons to gain wisdom and knowledge so that way they could be powerful enough to be with you because i feel like you're already powerful as hell this person is a high priest and they're going through some sort of like initiation or awakening right now so they, they could be thinking about you or whatever but so what's the high from reverse then yeah child a high priest is reverse <laughs> For some of you, this is a karmic couple. That's what I'm getting. What's this high from reverse? High priestess reverse. I'm hearing something about chicken. I just heard bourbon chicken. The Queen of Wands and the Knight of Cups. For some of you, in order to unlock something here about yourself, a gift or a relationship, something from your past life had to be dealt with. Like, well, that's mainly obviously for everybody. But for those of you that are readers or you do do something that's spiritual, you do spiritual work for a living, you obviously have a past life of doing that. And so in order for you to get something or move forward, something about you maybe had to balance out maybe some something about being too spiritual and not being practical enough right so this could be this could be shit this could be you awakening with the with the judgment here in the in the hierophant this could be a practical side of you that's balanced out or something that you needed to learn you've done the shadow work here because i feel like there was a blockage or something it's something about your inner child that needed to heal yeah the, the ten of pentacles in order for something to be balanced out Maybe something about following your heart or, you know, really being assertive, taking action to do something instead of just, you know, waiting for, I'm not going to say waiting for it to come to you because I feel like you know better than that. But maybe you, you weren't taking enough action or maybe you weren't taking a big enough leap of faith or something. But for some of you, there's like a dark witch and a dark, a dark high priestess and a dark high priest that are together. And they know that you have an offer coming towards you. Something is going to activate you. Activate. Your healing activated you anyways. But then I feel like somebody really is upset about you getting this offer. Or being attracted to somebody else. This Knight of Cups is coming towards you. Yeah, Three of Cups. There's going to be a reconciliation. Three of Cups, the world. Somebody or some of you guys are being celebrated online as well. But there's a dark high priestess here that's doing the most so this is like unwanted attention what's the high priestess reverse because you're for some of you this high from reverse is a dark uh is a warlock or they're in some sort of cult or coven they're in some sort of secret society with a bunch of dark witches or just because like it's just natural for this person to attract dark witches here because they're a warlock you know what i mean you could have been with this person in a past life or in the past they tried to sacrifice you in a past life. You wasn't going to be sacrificed this time. Yeah, look. Magician reverse, temperance reverse, and the Knight of Pentacles reverse. Exactly. Yeah, you're you're figuring out why or where some sort of drama is coming from. Could be Virgo, Sagitt another Sagittarius, Gemini. Somebody here could be clashing with people because they're making promises that they can't keep. Somebody here has made a promise that they just cannot keep here. So they're falling out with a community. Four of Wands reverse. They're going to have to take this out with them. Like handle this mess with this community or this whatever family shit they got going on. That they involved in some sort of in this mess. They're going to have to get it sorted out.
And this person, they they going at it with somebody because they first of all, they don't want to be seen a certain way. They definitely don't. But bitch, it looks like that's getting ready to be what's gonna happen. What's the high priestess reverse? Yeah, the Empress. What's the high priestess reverse? Yeah, unwanted attention towards the Empress. <laughs> like what towards Libra? What's the high priestess reverse with the Empress? Yeah, the seven of pentacles. So the Empress is here making good investments, growing, nurturing herself or himself, like doing the inner work, working on your creative projects, your your creative pursuits, endeavors. You got shit that you're manifesting here. You're making really good long-term investments. You're invested into something. So for some of you, what's being found out is that you're already invested into something. You're invested into something long-term. Okay. This is definitely an inheritance as well, too. You're sitting on a whole bunch of something. <laughs> so that's why there's so much unwanted attention. Because whoever this is trying to hide in the background, they know your, your path already before your ass do. <laughs> that's crazy. But now, I mean, now you do, obviously. But somebody here knew your potential before you did. And that's why they've been attacking your ass. You you growing and finding your worth here would unlock a certain part of you. And somebody didn't want that to happen. Somebody was trying to sacrifice you to be a dark witch. It's like, yeah, the King of Souls reverse. Or they got a whole bunch of dark witches to try to do this to you while they hide in the background. They wanted you to go down a dark path. Yeah, the devil. <laughs> Where else you know that? Yeah. But this is what you do, though. You face your demons. Queen of Swords here with the damn devil. Like, you're not scared of no fucking demon. You, especially if they if they the demon, you definitely not scared of they stupid ass or or lame hoe. <laughs> like you you face your demons. This person here thought she was gonna be scared of something, and you're not. Yeah, you just overcame something, and now you're getting blessed with something. <laughs> like what the fuck, child? What's the Queen of Swords? Yeah, Queen of Swords again. Period. And the devil that came back out again. It's like you see somebody, you see them as a the devil. I feel like you know this person too is possessed. They crazy. And you know that you're going up against a whole group of motherfuckers. Because this person, I can guarantee you they in a cult. I can guarantee you they in some sort of cult. Just period. <laughs> what's, the, what's the devil? Yeah, King of Swords, yep, that, that, the devil himself coming out. Yeah, your ex, somebody you used to be with. Yep. Yes, sir, Ski, is this... <laughs> I'm about to say something crazy, but it's definitely this bitch here. For sure. In some, into some sort of dark shit here. What's the devil with the King of Swords reverse? Very narcissistic, very controlling. Very much so a liar. And they brought a whole bunch of dark shit your way. But all it did was help you level up. So, yeah, two of cups. Somebody here lied about a relationship or they lied and said that they were still being with you or whatever the fuck this was. Because I feel like for some of you guys, you already have a relationship here. But somebody here lied on you. Yeah, King of Cups. You got somebody that truly loves you or whatever the case may be. What's the, Give me more. Give me the King of Swords specifically. Yeah, Virgo here. What's King of Swords in reverse? Nine of Pentacles. <laughs> Five of Cups upright. That shit wanted to flip our reverse. I mean, uh... Yeah, reverse. Yeah, whoever this is is still mad or upset about the past. Somebody here could be mad that you abandoned them or you didn't keep a promise. So they decided to do nasty shit to you or go join a damn whole damn cult that they don't even, they too weak to even stand up against. That's crazy. <laughs> this person here is stupid as fuck. Or shit, they could be powerful, but they ain't more powerful than you. They just need to leave you the fuck alone and go handle some shit or deal with somebody else that's their caliber because it's not you you way you too high ranking for this shit yeah whoever this is is hiding the fact that they're superficial materialistic and they're a slob they they lazy they don't have no work ethic or drive or goals this person here 
sad, <laughs> sad as fuck. Don't want to be seen a certain way. So they sit up here and lie and bring a whole bunch of devil shit your way. And all you do is overcome it. What's the two of cups? And they mad because they know that you're in love with somebody. What's two of cups? Yeah, seven of wands reverse. Yeah, something is unblocked here from this for this connection to go. Yeah, four of cups reverse. Moving out of a stalemate. What's the two of cups, seven of wands in the reverse? Somebody here insecure. They know that they can't match up to whoever this is you with. They're insecure. They could, could have been competitive. Yeah, they know that you don't got no respect for their ass. You lost all respect for their stupid ass. And they've been behind the scenes fucking with you because they know that, that you don't want to be with them. They know that. But they want to be with you. So they don't like, basically, they can't take rejection. <laughs> what's, the, what's, the, what's the two of cups, seven of wands reverse? They know that you don't respect them because of their nasty ass behavior. Yeah, the star in reverse. You see this person that's weak. They ain't got no respect for you. <laughs> so you don't want to be with them. What the fuck? The star reverse, Aquarius. I feel like somebody would do, I just heard do anything for clout. Like this person would do anything for attention. They need a lot of validation. Somebody here that don't set boundaries. <laughs> like they just, this is why you don't fuck with them. And they too busy in a south note. I feel like they, they lack motivation, drive. They get bored quickly. Somebody that's not healed. You see them as weak because that's what it is. Somebody here is just a lazy asshole that wants the easy way out of shit. And that's why they went to go join this cult or that's why the fuck they went to, if they didn't join, that shit scared me. If they didn't join a damn cult, they didn't, um, they just lost. They fallen from grace. What's the Wheel of Fortune reverse? Somebody here is in despair because something is... You see this person, they're in despair because you see them as the devil. That's exactly what they are. Yeah, Justice reverse. What's the Wheel of Fortune reverse? Yeah, Ace of Wands reverse. Yeah, delays, setbacks because somebody don't want to take accountability. But what they did, delays, setbacks, I feel like you're disinterested. This stay karma for you to be completely disinterested in their ass. Losing passion. <coughs> oh, excuse me. Damn, it's so nice to be able to sneeze at my tarot table because normally when I can't sneeze it's some sort of like um magic taking effect or something here that um I don't know but it definitely has some spiritual <laughs> okay because I can sneeze just fine off like away from my table but anyways <clears throat> all right you know it's just me channeling maybe but um yeah there's a lot of unwelcome changes here due to something from the past <laughs> that somebody here yeah king of wands reverse mm -hmm. what's the justice reverse here until they take accountability they're gonna keep getting fucked up yeah magician reverse yeah they don't want to take accountability for this fucking magic this manipulating shit that they did they they this person here getting bad karma because they abused their power that's why they were a trickster they're conniving and they decided to go the dark route with a community four wands reverse or their family or something like that <laughs> like what's the justice reverse magician reverse for some of you okay yeah the eight of cups and the six of cups reverse yeah you don't you walked away you're done completely because you've seen a bigger picture of a situation you walked away from them and you grew up that this is why they did magic on you and this is why they gained karma for that shit because you walked away from them you've seen the bigger picture of a situation while they were still holding on to you that's why they decided to do this damn magic but you walked away and this person decided to bring hell your way <laughs> like they decided to bring hell your fucking way because they couldn't get up, get over the past. And this is why they're getting karma. For trying to do black magic on somebody that don't want them. So the magic definitely didn't work. What's the Ace of Wands reverse? And somebody that's growing and maturing. <laughs> and they North know, bitch, the magic will definitely beat your ass. Because it's definitely not beating Sagittarius or whoever cross watcher. <laughs> What's the Ace of Wands reverse, Two of Wands reverse? 
Six of Wands. You guys should be seeing six, six, six. <clears throat> hmm. Yeah, Ace of Wands in reverse is like disappointing news too. Disappointing news. Or they were just trying to cause a delay for you. But that two of wands too. Somebody realizing that the grass is green on the, on your side. Of course it is, bitch. <laughs> what the fuck you mean? <clears throat> but you're you're disinterested in them now. You don't want them. You don't want their ass. You don't want to have shit to do with them. They can go fuck with this community and you know what I'm saying? That's what they wanted to do, so go ahead. What's the five of wands? Yeah, look at that ass. King of Wands reverse. Four of Cups reverse. Cancer Moon. We got Leo energy. What's this Four of Cups in the reverse? Yeah, something moving out of a stalemate for you. Ten of Pentacles, the World, and the Three of Swords in reverse. <laughs> this person here, they still in competition too. This person is crazy. Excuse me. And delusional. Because I feel like they're fighting themselves. <clears throat> like, really. You're completely healed. Some of you guys are reconciling with someone that's going to be your life partner. Yeah, Nine of Pentacles up here. You're definitely getting your Ten of Pentacles. Definitely, too. Could be starting a business here. Or something is going to grow. In a partnership. Or in some sort of business venture. Yeah. Then your new beginning is going to consist of complete peace. What's this damn King of Wands reverse? This Warlock. Okay, Ace of Cups. What's King of Wands reverse? Ace of Cups. Somebody here still competing or still doing whatever the fuck they're doing. That's just delusion. Yeah, the Ace of Swords reverse. After they didn't already lost. Ace of Swords reverse. They didn't already failed. Nine of Wands is, is somebody here really trying to go to war with your ass. It's a lot of arguing and shit like that going on. Ace of, Ace of Swords in the reverse. A lot of arguing or um, there's definitely hostility, animosity, or like somebody in a hostile environment. <laughs> or they trying to make your environment hostile, especially if you do work online. Like somebody, what's the Ace of, Wand Ace of Swords reverse? For some of you guys. Okay, yeah, the Ace of Pentacles. Wow, Ace of Cups, Ace of Swords reverse, Ace of Pentacles. Then we got the Ace of Wands reverse. <clears throat> What's the Ace of Souls reverse? Ace of Pentacles. For some of you guys, Spirit is trying to... Spirit getting ready to move you in a different direction. Because whatever, whatever you're doing is 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 where the hostility is. Like, yeah. The Page of Wands reverse and the Page of Cups reverse. I mean, upright. Yeah, you're in a, like a, a community where you're not being supported. For some of you, it's a spiritual community. If you do spiritual work or wherever you're at. If you're online doing something, it's time for you to go online somewhere else. Or... Something like that. <clears throat> I feel like you're playing small. Spirit wants you to go bigger. Is what I'm getting. Because this King of Wands in reverse. I just feel like they're still competing. Or they're still doing something. And it's happening like this for a reason. Because it's time for you to get like. Yeah it's time for you to go big or go home period. Yeah the lovers and the six of pentacles. <laughs> Something maybe that you've been running away from for a while. You're being guided to do it. The lovers and the six of pentacles. This could be a big career choice that you're going to make. Something about your money. Definitely, I would say it's about a connection, a relationship. And it could be. But for others of you, this is about your finances. You're going to have to make some big decisions about your money. This could be the, this masculine coming towards you. Your actual masculine. They could be coming towards you. But, and they could be in a hostile environment. There's somebody around them competing with them. Somebody could have to move to get to their Ten of Pentacles. Mm. Somebody here keeps on, I feel like somebody keeps on doing like something. I feel like this is spirit though, allowing this person to do this. Somebody keeps on going towards a, like new opportunities where they're at. 
or doing something new, trying to switch up something where they're at. And it's none of, none of it's working. It's all the wrong decision because somebody needs to be opening their heart or their mind to doing something else. So something's just going to keep repeating, repeating, repeating until somebody here moves or does something that spirit wants their ass to do. Just period. It's something brand new. And somebody here is in the Page of Cups looking for an Ace of Pentacles. The Ace of Pentacles could be in the same field, but it's time to like do something that's in that field that's like totally new. Okay. And it's, it's much... I don't know, it's much something, but it's much, I ain't gonna say better. I mean, it's better for you, but it's just, it's, it's something bigger too. Something that probably takes a little bit more work, but it's gonna come out of ease because it's your passion. You know, it's a gift that's embedded in you, so it's gonna flow naturally and it's not gonna feel like work. It probably is a lot of work, to maybe to get it started, but like once you do that, once you get past that part, everything gonna flow. Whatever this is. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah, man. <laughs> yeah. Okay, let's see. Hmm. Yep, yeah, child, look who came out. New residents. New residents. Somebody here need to move. I just said that. And for some of you, this person could be better than themselves. Like, somebody here needs to move. You or this person does. The person that's actually coming towards you. Because somebody keep on page ones with her. Somebody keep on doing something that's predictable. Something is just predictable. It's time to, like do away with that and do something else because it's clearly it's not working <laughs> give me more down here because i felt that's where that was supposed to go yeah mask feelings Hmm. Sexual fantasies. <laughs> Child. What's sexual fantasies? Sucker for love. Peace and happiness. <laughs> What's sexual fantasies with sucker for love? Love birds. Yeah, somebody here just dreams all day about being with you. Whoever this is down here, it feels like you're masculine that's trying to come in with that Knight of Cups up there and all that. This person... They going through judgment, the hierophant with the with the hermit. This person going through an awakening because I feel like that's their energy too. Yeah, spiritual intervention. <laughs> exactly. What's what's mass feelings? Yeah, unbalanced. Yeah, this why something unbalanced. Somebody here need to open up and express their feelings or something. Or what's mass feelings here? Or for some of you, there's somebody around this person that they don't know that has feelings for them still or. But they, they're causing an imbalance. And that's the issue. Somebody need, needs to disconnect from someone. Yeah, we got two-faced reverse. What's this two-faced in the reverse? Or something is just imbalanced because somebody here can't express themselves. It's a moody, yeah, not making sense. For some of you, somebody is just moody. Something, thrown, something is, is off about somebody's like, um, something is off about them. You could sense it though. You could definitely sense it. There could be, there's a dark witch somewhere where they at trying to sacrifice them. <laughs> they need to, they need to wake up. What's the new residence? Struggle. Yeah, that's the struggle. Somebody's stability. What's new residence here with struggle? This is why they're struggling. Yeah, delusional. Because they're being delusional. This person could be going through some sort of awakening here where things look a bit confusing for them. Or there's a dark witch doing something to their ass. One or the other. Like. And then they keep on hiding shit from you is what I feel. Like that's the problem too. 
this person got to learn how to trust you. They could have trust issues as well. So, you know, you just got to let this person go through their awakening. And I'm talking about a divine masculine that's going through real shit. I'm not talking about no damn karmic masculine that don't got a pot to piss in and a window to throw it out of. And they just causing trouble because they definitely over here. What's this over here then? Clarity. For some of you feeling complete. Okay, yeah, you've reached a certain level of consciousness, a higher level of consciousness here. Okay, so you can tell what's going on here. Yeah, opportunist. Yeah, you can see that somebody too is an opportunist. Somebody around either this person or somebody around your ass. You can see right through these people. What's opportunist? Yeah, changes at a soul level and broke. Yeah. <laughs> Hmm. Maybe somebody's going to get clarity, hopefully. <clears throat> somebody here making these changes. I feel like they're going to realize somebody's an opportunist or this is you. What's clarity? Yeah, wanting to provide for you. Not the one. Friends only at best. But somebody got passion for you, though. They're just heartbroken. Yeah, this is what somebody's trying to make it seem like that somebody's an opportunist and they're not making changes. Th th somebody is trying to attack someone's finances to make you think that that's not the person for you and they just are going to be asking you for help, asking you for help constantly. No. And somebody's trying to convince you, they try to convince you that they were not an opportunist and they were actually making changes at a, at a soul level and that's a lie. That's crazy. They say wanting to provide for you and but not the one, friends at best. Friends only at best. <laughs> like, you see right through that shit. Somebody that want to provide for you, I feel like really wants more than that. Or somebody here try to, like, sacrifice you and make you they, they, they sugar baby or something. Or they wanted you to, like, yeah, I got money, I got money, but I don't want, I don't want shit else from you. I just want to fuck on you and give you money. I feel like that's not what you want. <laughs> Child, that's crazy. And it's a feeling complete. So I feel like you heal from this or you see shit. You know what, what this is. What's feeling complete? You can see people for who they are. Yeah, healing. Thank you, spirit. Exactly. What, what's this up here? Yeah, it's a elevating in my divinity. Understanding the truth of it all on a deeper level. Well, and choices. Street credit, <laughs> reverse, whatever it takes. It's child. Let's see, what street credit in damn reverse? Pointing the finger. <laughs> For some of you, this is a fake ass street nigga. I just heard, yeah, heating up. Yeah, they in trouble. They in trouble. <laughs> For some of you, somebody is in trouble. Whoever this the karmic masculine is that I pulled in, this person getting ready to get in some trouble. They can't even uphold their own reputation. This person wanted some sort of validation from the streets. <laughs> okay. Child. Mm. Then they try to point the finger on you, put everything on you so that way they, they reputation can stay clean or they can look like something to the streets. That's crazy. <laughs> like, that is absolutely in fucking insane. Insane. Oh. And embarrassing when I mean, you could just be yourself. Now you in some shit you don't even. Let me see something. Now you now you probably involved in some shit that you don't even fucking. What what else? I mean, not what else. Let me put that back. What's this up here? Transformation. Yeah, new door opening. Some of y'all have just gotten a new home or something. Yep, destiny is calling you. Decline or answer. It looked like you answering it. Yep, that, that's that's a whole transformation up there. Then you have somebody here that's down low. Here go that down low ass coming out. <laughs> here go that down low ass coming out. Bisexual, same sex, off limits, mental, physical illness. <laughs> Whoever this is. Constantly fighting, famous. Some of y'all could be seen in a public eye. They've been trying to throw mess your way or they with somebody else that they fighting with about you. Yeah. Child, please. 
Mm -mm. But this is your reading, Sagittarius. I hope it resonated. Like, comment, subscribe, turn your notification bell on, press the all button so you won't miss my reads. And I'll talk to you all later. Bye.